October 27th is when Nintendo will release Super Mario Odyssey for the Nintendo Switch. I have the game pre-ordered, so I'll be playing it the day it comes out. But before the game comes out, let's discuss it. I'm really looking forward to this game. Why? Well, it has so many unique features that I'll get into in a second, but also the fact that I can play this huge new game wherever I go. Pretty much everyone's first reaction to this game is what, why, and how. Because never before has Mario been interacting with humans. He's been going on his own quests, which involves stomping on brown mushrooms and walking through pipes that takes him to new worlds. In Mario Odyssey, everything looks so colorful and the graphics look premium. On top of that, Super Mario Odyssey has so many different kingdoms to explore. We know that this game is going to be an open world sandbox game like Super Mario Sunshine in 64. So you're going to have a whole bunch of kingdoms to explore, one of them is a New York City like map, and you'll get to explore so much else because the game has an open world. The game also has a story that's pretty unique for the basic Mario formula. From what I can tell, Bowser is trying to marry Peach and you have to stop them. Not Bowser has kidnapped Peach and you have to get her back. It's not a revolutionary story, but it's different. Also, it looks like instead of the generic Koopa kids, there is now bunny-like enemies, so that's also different. Then you have the unique features, like for example, Mario can take over his enemies and control them. Mario's hat also can be used as a platform, which allows for some new platforming tricks. There's also a huge amount of small details in this game, like for example, the ability to damage some bits of New Donk City. But the best part about all of this is the fact that you can play this game with all of its features, not a cut down version, the same game, wherever you go. And that is huge because the Nintendo Switch could benefit from this. I said in my recent Stardew Valley video that I don't see people going out and buying a Switch just to play that game, but with Super Mario Odyssey, I can see people going out and getting a Switch just to play that game, which again, could benefit the Switch. Super Mario Odyssey, without a doubt, is going to be the biggest Switch game so far. Is it bigger than Breath of the Wild? Well, I mean, it could be, but Breath of the Wild is also on the Wii U, so I don't really want to count that one because it's not a straight Switch exclusive. So in my opinion, the biggest Switch game so far that's only available on the Nintendo Switch is Super Mario Odyssey. I'm going to be getting the game, but I'm not going to be streaming it because Nintendo almost completely blocked people's ability to stream their games. But I'll try to review the game if I get the chance to. So, if you did find this interesting, please share this video on social media, it really does help. Please leave your thoughts on this in the comments and I'll try to reply to you. I'll have a link to my Discord server in the description if you want to join that. And, see you.